Oh, hey, Sophia. I thought I gave you a house key. Anyway, our vacation awaits. Sorry, Mia. I swear I had it. Oh, no. Y you lost my key? Oh, my gosh. What if someone finds it that's trying to break in? Or what if my mom finds it? Your mom? <sighs> you know what? It's okay. I've been thinking about installing a biometric lock anyway. I have no idea what that is. Siri, what is biometric? Yeah, there! That's biometrics. What? Your phone. It recognizes the face of the person it belongs to. You see, biometrics is technology that recognizes people the way we recognize each other, by physical features. A familiar face or a voice, the way we walk or behave. You see, keys are things we have, or had, and we also verify identity through password. I'm pretty forgetful. That's the great part about biometrics. Nothing to remember. They use something we always have with us, like our eyes. You don't have to remember anything. All you have to do is hold still. Speaking of holding still, we've got to not do that. We'll miss our flight. Fingerprints are a biometric too, but you have to touch a sensor, which isn't always practical. Then there's face recognition. Although it needs to deal with changes in appearance due to lighting or aging, there's voice recognition too. But you do have to watch out for background noise. Airports are full of biometric technology because unlike passwords, keys, and ID cards, biometrics can't be easily stolen or lost. They're unique to each of us. We each have our own. Huh. So one day I may not even need a wallet. It's true. If you wanted, you could link all the information you have to carry with you now, like credit cards and ID, to a biometric instead. And how does that work? But it's really not as complicated as you think. I'll tell you all about it. Whew. After my nap. Mm.